What is going on, everybody? I'm your boy Retro Bliss, and this is Retro Bliss Gaming. It is Tuesday. I hope everybody's having a good day so far. We're having, we got a party going on. We got cannabis in the house. We got Operation Shutdown. Fixoid from France is in. He said he's in. He's in holidays over there, so he's uh, hanging out with us. I appreciate that. Uh, he's a he's been a big contributor to the channel. Uh, he's uh, provided a bunch of homebrews for the Sega Master System. I love the Sega Master System. It's one of my favorite consoles ever. Uh, I don't know why, but it is just an amazing console. But anyway, I love the Sega Master System. But um, anyway, welcome to the channel. If you're new, we invite you to subscribe, turn on your notifications. Welcome. We're gonna have some fun today. Um, we love the Atari on this channel, but uh, we are new to uh, the launch box, and I want to kind of um, experiment with this a little bit, and we're going to play some other games on the launch box. Just kind of the launch launch box is just basically a front end. It's not an emulator itself. It's just a front end that uses RetroArch. It uses MAME, and it uses some other emulators for like PS2 and Wii. I'm not sure which PS2 and Wii emulators it uses to emulate those games. I'll have to look into that because I haven't uh, imported those, those ROMs into it yet to figure out which ones. But um, it's just a front end to play your games. And we'll also um, uh, import your uh, Steam games and, and other Windows games like that. Um, and it's just kind of an all-in-one place for Windows. And uh, Operation Shutdown, um, uh, he, he plays, he emulates on a uh, Mac. And Mac has an um, emulator on there that is excellent called open emu and it is very similar to this the only difference is that um the layout is very similar but open emu it's it's an emulator all on itself it, it it the layout is the same but it it's an emulator all to itself it emulates and displays the games all in one just like this launch box is just a front end that's all it is it's not an emulator it just basically displays the games and then it launches the emulators uh, and the emulators are what plays the games in Windows. But nonetheless, LaunchBox is really cool because it organizes all the games. It displays the boxes, which, you know, it's kind of nice having the emulators on your Windows. But, you know, when you're scrolling through the games and you see the boxes and you're looking for the games to play, it's kind of nice to see the, the game boxes, you know, uh, it's like having them on your on your game shelf and just kind of scrolling through and seeing what games you want to play. It's just a little different. So, um, yeah. So anyway, um, I have been going through the um, my ma list of main games that I have on my uh, PC, and uh, Bubble Bobble is a game that I had not really played. But it looks like a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of fun. And it's a very popular game, I know. And so, we're going to play Bubble Bobble today. We're going to learn to play this together. <laughs> so, try not to make fun of me too bad. Like I said, we don't... We don't show expert gameplay on this channel. We just, we just like to have fun. So... I do want to show you that if you right click on this, sometimes if you go to where it says play version, like look at all the different versions. When you import your main game, sometimes there's like multiple versions of the bubble bobble that'll, that'll pop up. So you can kind of pick the different versions that you want to play. I don't know which version is which, you know, there's bootleg versions. There's, um, the Japanese versions or prototype versions. I just double click on it. That's all I do. 
And again, when you install, there's a link in the description for LaunchBox. If you're new to it, you want to download it. Um, when you install it, it's going to ask you if you want to um, keep track of your high scores. You want to do that because it will keep track of your high scores for you, which is something that you can't really do uh, with uh, RetroArch alone that I'm aware of. So this is really nice. I was uh, playing Galaga and I got my high score in there and I got out of the game and then I got back into it and it was keeping track of my high score. And so I thought that was really cool. So it's kind of a, a nice little feature. So anyway, let's get, let's put some credits in there and play again, not really, uh, uh, expert in this game, but we're gonna we're gonna play it. See what happens. Ah. Ah, which is shoot. Can't go down there. I gotta be careful. I died. That's my first complete game ever. Okay, let's uh let's uh play again. I'm not sure what a super game is. I thought I was shooting him.
No, I thought I shot him. Dirty dogs. Your bubbles can get in the way. I need those fries. There's fries up top. Oh, I missed them. Oh, no! Oh, no! He turned direction on me! I like the bezels. Um, I had a, and I, I kind of want you guys' uh, input on this. Um, I can play this game to where I had the screen before where I'm in the top left with the, the main logo in the bottom or the retro or the launch box logo in the bottom left and then the game in the, on the right side. But this way, the game screen is bigger, and you have the game bezel, and I'm just in the bottom right here like this. Let me know which way you like better. No, how'd I touch him? No. No. How in the world? No! Where am I supposed to go? No! That's it. I'm dead. So Michael, uh, Michael Hayes has a, um, I'm going to stop right here. Um, 
Michael has a um, Intellivision channel, and I don't have him set up as administrator. Let me get out of this for a minute. I'm going to make Michael a moderator. Um, Michael, put your, um, put your channel link in the, um, in the chat so everybody knows your channel so they can subscribe and, uh, check it out. He does a lot of cool and television stuff. It's on Twitch, that's right. Oh, I missed the banana. Oh, how? No way. What am I supposed to do? No, how'd I die? I didn't know like those things could kill me.
How'd the red one come about? No! I was gonna fall off. No, I was too close. Dang it. No, no. No, 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 no. I couldn't get away. Dang it. Somehow I did better though. I love Launchbox because it keeps your high scores. Which, by the way, guys, um,. I'm wrapping up uh, uh, editing the first episode for my for our 1,000 subscriber celebration. It looks like it's going to be a two-parter. The first part is going to be shorter than the second part, uh, but it's the first part still an hour long or more, <laughs> so it's going to be long. But it's going to be entertaining. So it's just interviews. That's all it is. And it's all about you guys. It's not going to be about the channel. It's going to be about all you guys. So uh, it's going to be awesome. <clears throat> I think I had like 11 or 12 total interviews. No! I hit fire! I know I hit fire. No. Ah. No. How? No, no. Dang it. No, I thought that was ice cream. I'm a sucker. I thought it was ice cream. I always go for the ice cream. Poop.
Okay, let's go again. I like this game. No! Oh, he jumped over me. Did you see that? I'm scared. No! I was scared to jump over. Where am I at? No! That red thing I'm not supposed to touch! Oh, get down there. Well, oh, I couldn't get to it. No! Michael, you're funny. Oh. All right. Michael says that there's a, a pun between ice cream and sucker here. <laughs> yeah, I agree. All right. All right, let's go. Who needs ant stream?
Be interesting with two players. Nope. Couldn't get the peach. No! Dog. No, come on, what is going on here? No, people. No! Oh, I fell down there. I couldn't get to it. I want to get the sucker. No! Dog. Not good. Ugh. Mike from Mike's Gaming Gala. I think I got my mic thing fixed out. I tell you what, man, I stream with OBS, which is a free um, open source uh, streaming software. And I don't know why, but the mic, something's going on with the, when you, the, I don't know what it is, but the mic, you have to like uninstall and reinstall your mic, uh, from it every now and then, because it won't, it won't stay consistent. It was distorting on me really bad the last day or so. Anyway, what's going on guys? Thanks for stopping by. We are playing Bubble Bobble, and I had never played Bubble Bobble until today, really. I'm having fun with it. Hope every oh, hope everything's streaming okay now. Seriously. Didn't get the banana. Too close. I did it again. What? No. 
seriously? Let's go. I think my granddaughter's gonna like this when I show it to her. Uh, seriously, people. No! <sighs> this game is not going well. I was pushing fire! Ah! I was talking to the guys. One thing about LaunchBox, it keeps track of your high scores in MAME, which is great, man. Press some fire and press jump like a moron. Oh, I couldn't even do a rage reset. This is not good. No, I was trapped. It started coming at me. No! Oh, it's going. I forgot what was going down there.
Oh, the red things! Dog! Oh! Dog, gone it. <sighs> All right, we're improving. Even though that game started off horribly, I actually came came back there. I'm trying. Nope. Dang. I thought I hit fire. What happened? No, 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 no. Ah. What is a super game?
No, he fought. He fired at me. I'm moving faster. No, I just jumped on him. No, no, he fired. They're firing at me. I don't like that. They're firing at me. I don't like that. I think I'm yelling in the mic. I'm sorry. No! What is going on? I'm trapped. Oh, I just got killed.
No! I was trying to get him! No! Trying. No. No! They won't do that! Well, guys, that was good. That was good. Yeah, uh, I had a fun, I had a fun guest on uh, Sunday, and I used to do that a little bit more often than I have, and I probably will be doing that a little bit more often. I had my granddaughter on here, and um, she's going to be on my thousand subscriber episode that I'm going to be uh, having on uh, real soon, so you guys will, you guys will be in for a treat. You guys probably missed some of the episodes that I've had uh, her on before, so anyway. But anyway, listen, guys, I've had a bunch of fun with this, and uh, thanks for hanging out with me. I'm not sure if I'm going to be streaming a little bit later. I might be, but I want to kind of get this uh, this uh, episode uh, up and running and, and published, so I think that's going to be my priority today. If I can stream a little bit later, I might, but I'm not 100% sure about that. But anyway, thanks for hanging out, guys, um, and appreciate you guys being on, so... Uh, you guys, thanks for hanging out, and uh, we will be uh, seeing you on the next one. Thanks for hanging out. Take care.